Hello my beautiful people, welcome or welcome back to my channel and today we are back with another reaction video. Today is the long awaited and long requested follow up on 8 He's. Now I have been wanting to do this for the longest time because after the first video I literally and I kid you not like I fell into the biggest 80s loophole ever like I was researching everything i was researching the order of their songs but it was actually so easy because a lot and i mean a lot of you guys flooded the comments okay you guys were dominating the comment section and to be honest i did not mind drowning at all you guys are the most welcoming fandom i have ever like witnessed i'm not gonna lie and it was just so nice and it was such a warm welcome because the only boy group that i've ever like really really stand and really felt at home with was got seven and then after that i never really found a fandom that was like as welcoming as you guys were and for that i am very thankful but yeah so we're gonna hop right into it today we are reacting to four songs and what we're gonna do is we're gonna do them like like chronologically and this is just for me to kind of get into their storyline and understand some of the songs that I reacted to um, on the first video so without further ado let's hop right into it let's go okay so we are starting off with pirate king let's go Okay, okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. I need to go back because ooh, the vibe just completely changed. The vibe is getting hot. Are y'all hot? I'm hot. Okay, hold on. You know, there's something so beautiful about like some of the soft moves that they put in there. Like, it's just so smooth. Like this. Hey. Oh, 
Okay, okay. Okay, Pirate King. Honestly, if I would have heard the full song the first time it was released, I would have instantly, instantly been like intrigued. No kidding. Like, I, this would have been like, I would have been part of the fandom from the moment I heard this song. I really like it. Again, now I see that from the very beginning, it's very normal for them to have like a couple of different vibes in one song, but they coexist. It's like they're taking you on a ride and they're showing you different sceneries, but it's not like you're going from New York to Mars, okay? It's like it takes steps between New York and Mars, you know what I mean? But um, considering that this is like their first music video, I feel like it's more of a performance video and maybe this is because they come from like a small company but I don't think it was like a bad move to have it this way because um, considering that they were known previously as KQ fellas I feel like this was a very smooth transition into them being ATs if that makes sense so for the music video itself like I think it's actually quite nice that it's a performance video and uh, yeah it's a really fun song and I feel like yeah it's kind of hard to come up with like a music video concept for this one especially if it's like a debut as ATs um, but I think they did really well I love the song I love the beat drop okay I was like mm, mm. anyway that was the first one let's move on to the second one and the second one is treasure let's go Ooh. 
Okay, okay, okay. Okay, this one is a little bit more, a little bit softer. But I feel like this one really helped like the vocals shine so much. And also, I feel like the rap parts, the rap parts felt like freestyles. You know, you know that that like feeling you get of freestyle songs. That's how kind of how it sounded like, and I actually like that. It's a nice, it's a nice little new tone in what they have. Okay, so personally, this one is mm, it's it's fifty fifty. It's really nice. I think if I heard it in the time, I would have enjoyed it. But I feel like now this one is a little bit more toned down. And this could also be just, this could also be just to like soft launch them a little bit further. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like they already came with a bang during uh, Pirate King, and then Treasure is like a little bit of like a softer introduction to 80s, in my opinion. Um, I really liked it. The vocals, the vocalists, really, really, really shine in this song, and overall, it was very chill. Gave me gave me kind of the break that i need my feelings are all over the place okay these people have me feeling all type of way and this was a nice breather i liked it so yeah i'm moving on to the third one so the third one is say my name i know say my name okay say my name was iconic but i have never listened to the full song and i have never seen the music video Yes, I know. It's a shame. I'm sorry. But we're fixing it, right? We are we're fixing the problem. Don't mind if I sing along cuz I know I don't sing my name, sing my name, sing my name. <laughs> Anyways, let's get started. Let's go. Okay, so I'm guessing that this is where the storyline really starts to set. Like, really starts... Like, this is the start of the storyline, I'm guessing, right? Because there's... Okay, we know what's coming next but i just want to i just want to because i know i'm gonna be enjoying this but i did not expect say my name to start so soft i'm surprised like with the guitar like it's very soft very very mellow kind of but damn okay Oh, 
say like the set of this music video stunning hello i think it's only like three or four different um spaces but it didn't feel like that it didn't feel like it was limited it, it they, they make such good use of every space that they have and uh the, the the choreo like we didn't see a lot of the choreo but the movements that we did see like i love sometimes how they add like really soft touches to the choreo like the um oh i don't know man there's something about this group that just ugh, i can't i cannot wrap my head around it i just i can't say my name actually is quite different than what i thought it was gonna be like i thought it was gonna be some crazy like full of beats type of song but surprisingly it's so soft i like it i'm pleasantly surprised this one is definitely going on my playlist i don't i don't know which playlist yet but this is this is going on there the hundred percent um we're gonna move on and we are going to listen to Hala Hala. The only official music video that I see is a performance version, but I'm guessing this is the only version, right? If it's not, please let me know because maybe I missed a couple of things when I was like researching. But yeah, we're just gonna we're just gonna hop right into it. just an intro okay cool wait aren't these the what they were wearing like in the previous music video right like sitting opposite of 
I'm still learning guys, okay? I'm still learning like the storyline, but I'll call them for now, I'll call them like the regular ATs, like the normals, the normal ATs, and then these dark pirates situation with the masks. So these were sitting opposite of the normal ATs, which is just ATs, but obviously maybe from another dimension, if I'm not wrong. This is them, right? I honestly love like the walk that they do on like the second verse of the chorus It's so satisfying Well, that was something else, wasn't it? That was that was nice. I don't. That was really nice. I liked it. Wait, so like there, the the dance was the like. <laughs> I'm speechless to be honest. That's actually really. I like this song. I think. Okay, I'm. I said it in the first part, but I think I'm genuinely in love with the rappers. I'm just a rap person kind of gal, okay? I really like this. I I don't understand why there is no like music video, more performance video, because it says official music video, but then in brackets it's like performance version. So is there a non-performance version? I mean, it's fine. It's fine. I don't think there is, but. We have a lot to go through, guys. We have a lot to go through. Um, but so far, I am so presently surprised. And 
I think I might give some of the earlier al albums a listen because I was just waiting until I did this video because I want to like get to know them alongside you guys because you guys helped me out so much when I did the first one because basically what happened with the first one is I reacted to um, I think I reacted to three songs and Everyone in the comments was like, girl, like you're watching these music videos, like the storyline is messed up and everything. And which makes sense because I was watching these music videos and I'm like, okay, there's a storyline somewhere, but I don't know what it means. I don't know what this music, like the significance of the music video, I didn't know. So that's why I kind of want to explore them like step by step with you guys because you guys are so, so helpful. So now that I did this first part, I did, uh, I think treasure episode one and two i'm not sure if i finished like episode two i think i finished episode two so now i'm just gonna like listen to the rest of the songs on the album alone maybe i don't know maybe if you guys want to listen with me maybe i can try like live streaming or something i've never done live streaming before so that's kind of kind of something that i'm like super unfamiliar with but you guys let me know like maybe what's the best course of action to learn about this the, like the four songs that i listened to today which means that obviously this is going to be like a series type of thing um and i am just gonna try to upload um the episodes or the parts as closely together as i can um but yeah i am so excited to do this because ugh, I have I'm having the time of my life I don't know about you guys but um, yeah so next time we're gonna do we're gonna keep doing like 444 until their most recent comeback which I really want to listen to like I have been skipping all the TikToks I have been skipping all the Instagram posts everything I have been skipping everything about their recent comebacks because I really want to experience everything for the first time so yeah with that being said that is it for today's video if you liked it give it a big thumbs up and don't forget to wow and don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you want to see more and i will see you guys next time bye